Okay, so found uh, Cadbury caramel slices, caramel, uh, caramelized white chocolate, flowing caramel, vanilla flavored cream, and chocolate biscuit pieces. That's this here. Um, I found this at BP. You remember I said that with the last one with the vanilla passion fruit, I said. Um, I went at the end of the week and they only had the vanilla passion fruit at Pack and Save Wine Only. And I was like, well, I couldn't find the caramel or any other ones. Um, well, I found this one, but it was at BP. So instead of paying $2.49, I paid $5.99. Uh, not cheap, but I wanted to try it and I can't get anywhere else at the moment. Um, unless, you know, Pack and Save gets more in. Um, I thought I'd just buy it at BP, but I mean, maybe I'll enjoy it more if it costs more. Inside. There's the actual chocolate there, so you can see there. See what people meant. Mm. It's very, very good. Mm. Yeah, they're very, very, very rich. I couldn't eat more than a row at a time. Um, should last a while in that case. Um, very rich. I do like the white chocolate sort of caramel. Um, you know the flavour. The biscuit pieces add like a new dimension to it, so it's a bit better than normal caramel. And it's got that cream stuff in the middle. Um, as it says, vanilla flavor cream, so it adds like another dimension to it as well. Definitely better than the passion fruit for sure. Um, well, actually, I didn't mind the passion fruit, but this one's definitely a lot better. Um, I'll give it an 8 out of 10. It's very, very sweet though. If you haven't got a sweet tooth, you probably won't like it. If you do, like me, then um, even even for me, it's just such a very, very rich. Um, you'll probably like it in that case. If you like normal caramel milk, I recommend this one. And yeah. Yeah, I'll give it maybe 8 out of 10. Uh, anyway, so I'll leave that for there uh, for now. And I may or may not do a another chip review, um, like I said, potato chips, um, this afternoon. There's the Heartland Radio Hauraki chips. I've got the, like, Korean fried chicken or something on that. Um, whatever they're called, I've got to try those. And... There's a couple of other, other ones in that range. I don't know if they still have them at Pack and Save. I should have bought them when I had the chance, but I didn't. So if I missed out on those, so be it. Um, I mean, I don't eat too many chips anyway, so yeah, it doesn't matter. Anyway, I'll leave it there. Uh, yeah, ciao for now, and we'll catch you on the next review.